hey guys so i am back with another video and this is two in a row whenever you've seen this video i would have just posted my onion juice recipe video check it out right there and whenever you are seeing this video i will be posting my quarantine and beyond hair challenge so check it out as well the day after this video is posted so welcome back to my channel i'm channel mafre I produce natural hair content as well as lifestyle content because I share with you snippets from my everyday life. Um, and this one is a natural hair video and in this one I will be speaking about how I make my cayenne pepper infused oil. And cayenne pepper infused oil is nothing new to the natural hair community. I first began my natural hair journey after being relaxed in 2011 and even then cayenne infused oil was a big thing. Cayenne infused oil is great for stimulating hair growth and it's great for stimulating hair growth because of the element in cayenne pepper which causes it to burn. The burning that happens when you ingest cayenne pepper happens because of an inflammatory response. So what happens is that the body sends blood flow to the area and in an oversimplified way that is essentially the same thing that happens when you apply cayenne pepper infused oil to your scalp you can use it to massage your scalp you can use it as a spot treatment in areas where you have thinning or balding or you notice that you have lost hair and what will happen is that it will stimulate the hair follicles because blood will be rushed to the area and with the rushing of blood to this area you also have the rushing of nutrients. These nutrients will feed your follicles. You also have the rushing of different enzymes that will help with stimulating hair growth and stimulating your follicles and stimulating cell regeneration in the area. Um, and so that essentially helps with hair growth. So back in the day, we would use two tablespoons of cayenne pepper to one cup of oil and we were instructed to place it in a dark bottle place it in your closet and let it infuse for three weeks and if you did not have a dark bottle you were asked to wrap it in cloth and let it sit for two to three weeks this time around i used the same measurements i used two tablespoons of cayenne pepper and i used one cup of oil i used different types of oil but they all came together to make one cup um, however, I first used my oil way before the two to three week mark and it was just as effective. So here's what, if you leave your oil for the two to three week mark before using it, it means that your oil is super, super potent. If it's your first time using cayenne infused oil, I would say to dilute that oil, which essentially means for me that you can begin using the oil earlier. I used my oil two days in and it was very potent. I did feel the stinging. Um, and so I think that you can use your oil as early as one day after to two days after. What we used to do back in the day is every time we used some oil from the container, we would add new oil so that that new oil would be infused afresh and so that the oil would not be as potent. Um, so you can choose what method you want to do it. Something else you can do is after infusing for a period of time that you think acceptable you can remove the oil from the cayenne pepper to stop the infusion process it would be sufficiently infused by that time um, so these are all options that you have how do you use cayenne infused oil personally i use cayenne infused oil right before i wash so i use it to massage my areas i do not use it daily i think once a week is often enough because it is very potent. Also, you don't want to overstimulate your follicles so that they no longer respond to stimulation. I would say that once a week is often enough to use cayenne infused oil. You can apply it to your entire scalp. I do that and I give it a massage and I also do a hot oil treatment or sometimes I all just apply it to my areas that require additional stimulation such as my edges but it is most effective when applied directly to your scalp that is where its benefits lie what happens when you use cayenne infused oil you may feel a tingling depending on how potent your recipe is and how sensitive your skin is i use my oil two days after infusing it and i did feel some tingling it was not unbearable it would be wise to do a spot treatment 
to determine how potent your oil is and how sensitive you are um, so you can try it one day before see how you react to it and then determine whether you need to dilute your oil and just to wrap it up I just want to ask you guys to like the video of course share the video with a friend if a friend is experiencing hair loss these are the ingredients that I used in the first two years of my natural hair journey where I recorded the most growth to date. Um, they've always been part of my hair regimen, but somehow I've never captured them on camera. So I just wanted to make sure I capture it on camera for you guys so that you guys get a little bit more insight into what my regimen actually contains. <music> so heavy